Hey there, I'm Dassey from PartnersInCrimeGFX.com and in this tutorial, I'm going to be showing you guys how to make an opening transition and a closing transition in Blender. If you don't have Blender, you can download it by using the link in the description. And if you want access to the tutorial result and access to special Patreon-only intro templates and outro templates, you can check out our Patreon page and help support our channel for just $1 a month by using the link in the description. Don't forget to subscribe and leave a like for more Blender tutorials and Blender templates. So the first thing we're going to do is press numpad 7 and then control alt numpad 0 to go into camera view. Next we're just going to drag this up a bit and we're going to change this to audio video sync. Change the start frame to 0. We're going to put the resolution up to 100% and the frame rate up to 60 frames per second so that we have a smooth full sized animation. And we're going to hover over our screen here and we're going to press X and press delete to delete the default cube. Next we're going to press add curve bezier and we're going to press tab and we're going to press V and make that a vector and we're going to press tab and we're going to press RZ and rotate that on the Z axis a bit and we're going to press S and size that up a bit and the next thing we're going to do is add curve circle and we're just going to drag this out of camera view and we're going to press S and size that down a bit and we're going to press and we're going to right click on our curve and we're going to make the bevel object our bezier circle. So we're going to right click on our bezier circle and press S and slice that up and left click to confirm and we're just going to drag that up a bit. I'm going to right click on that and we're going to press SZ0. I'm going to press enter and what we're going to do now is we're going to size up our curve by pressing S and we're going to give it a new material. I'm going to drag this down so we can see our circle back there. And we're going to press new on material to give it the new material and press shadeless. And we're going to make this green to make this a green screen. And we're going to go into the curve settings. And we're going to go to frame 60. And what we're going to do is we're going to hit I over our bevels. And we're going to go to frame 0. And we're going to drag that down and we're going to hit I to insert the keyframes. We're just going to play that through. And as you can see, we have a basic closing transition. So what we're going to do is we're going to split the screen. And we're going to go into our dope sheet. And we're going to press SX and reverse that. And we're going to press G and drag this to the start. And that changes it to an opening transition. Now what we're going to do is we're going to press shift D and we're going to go to the object settings and move that back and we're going to press the plus on our material and we're going to give it a new material and we're just going to move that out and that way we have a little bit of color back there. So now we have a opening transition which is commonly used for intros for green screen intros and if you want to reverse the animation you can just reverse it back by pressing SX and reversing it and left clicking to confirm and make that a closing transition as well. So thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe for more tutorials and templates from Partners in Crime GFX. So thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe and like this video for more Blender tutorials and Blender templates.